Hello, this is Arcady116 with a South Park Stick of True um, Fighter playthrough. I guess this is part four of the uh, playthrough. I haven't played it for a little while, so thought I'd continue. Oops. <laughs> Forgot what I had to do. You fight well, douchebag, but to truly succeed in combat, you must learn to harness the power of your farts. Farting on an opponent at precisely the right time is key to battle. I shall show you how it's done, but first, you must take the gentleman's oath. You must promise to never, ever fart on anyone's bows, okay? Farting on an opponent is necessary, but farting on someone's bows is not cool. You understand? All right, then let's begin your training. To conjure dragon shouts, you must first clear your mind and take in a deep breath through your butthole. Like so. Hey. Then, let it rumble inside you, and... Dragon shout! I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Dragon shout! Now you. Ready? Dragon shout! Find the frequency. Oops. You don't need to hold it in, dude. You're not some chick at a party. I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Dragon shout! Now you. Ready? Dragon shout! I haven't done this for a long time, so as you guys can probably see, My God, that it took me an extra incredible. try. A man could live a hundred years and never again witness a spell so boisterous. Could it be that the prophecies are true? Could it be that the dragonborn has come at last in our hour of need? Now let us try your skill on a real opponent. Hey, hey, Princess Kenny. <laughs> could you come here a sec? <laughs> Shh, don't tell Okay, just real quick, Princess Kenny. Sir Douchebag wants to show you something. All right, you two. Spar! Sir Douchebag, show Princess Kenny the magical powers I have taught you. <laughs> that was fucking hilarious! <laughs> Dude, that was fucking awesome! <laughs> oh, okay, good job, Sir Douchebag. That was sweet. Thanks, Princess Kenny. That's all for now. Thank you, Uncle. <laughs> okay, okay, but... Dude, seriously, remember, don't ever do that on someone's balls, okay? Seriously. You have mastered dragon shafts. From now on, it will be easier for you. That's probably like 90% of all people know. Now go get Craig while I rest and relax upon my throne. That whole dragon shout thing is, is kind of a uh, making fun of the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Because in that game, um, you're supposedly the dragonborn and you're able to use these these shout shouting abilities called dragon sh dragon shouts my favorite game of all time is the elder scrolls 3 morrowind and skyrim's okay but i don't know I, it just didn't feel it just didn't grip me the same way that morrowind did i just didn't enjoy it as much i still played it a lot i mean i I beat the game twice, if I remember right, but I don't know. I don't think I'll ever play it again, but if people really want me to, I can play it. I mean, it's not my favorite game, but we can have some fun with it, I suppose. I'm counting on you. Get Craig back here alive. What, you? You want me to fight with you? Okay. Your is ready to kick your ass. Okay. Looks like I gotta go rescue Craig. Okay. I don't have the uh, fast travel to the school yet, but I can fast travel fairly close. I thought I already looted all this, but guess not. Oops. Yeah, might as well go with Kenny for a bit, eh?
Okay, I thought, thought I could actually just click on him to get him to be in my uh, group. But I guess not. Oh well. We got him in our uh, our party now anyway, so. How many car crashes have you been in? Ooh. What an asshole. Ow. As you can see, I'm feeling all the change again, like I usually do. Oops. And I got stuck for a second there. Attention, okay? Stop looking at your watch because you're here for three hours, buddy, okay? Whatever. Now don't think your friends are gonna come bust you out this time, Craig. My name is Feldspar, and I'm a level six thief, and the humans will soon rescue me from this tower. No, your name is fucking Craig Tucker, and you're in detention. Now start doing your homework, okay? I've got all the doors sealed, and I've got hallway monitors working overtime. Nobody's gonna save your ass today, Craig, okay? Yeah, I just thought I'd, uh, try to get that. Okay, I guess I have to do the tutorial thing, eh? With the die. I was hoping that I could avoid it, but... Oh, well. Okay, I need to be level 4 for that. Okay. Looks like technically Kenny's club is better than what I had. Oh, you can't die, headgear. I was kind of hoping you could. Oh, well. Can't even die gloves, either, for that matter. Uh, let's see here. Okay. Hopefully, um... Yeah, let's go with red. Oh, never mind. <laughs> uh, it's funny. There we go. Okay. Now, hopefully that stuff disappears for a while, because I don't really care too much about dying right now. Because I want to play. Excuse me, but school is out, and no students allowed on the premises until tomorrow at 7.30 a.m. You are in reach of school law and must be punished! <laughs> the good old gingers, eh? Just for the heck of it, we're going to... We're going to use the Dragon Shout. There we go. 
Like riding a bike, eh? Oh crap. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh. Officer down. Officer down. Send back up. <laughs> I seriously screwed up that attack. All hallway monitors to the right hallway. Oh god damn it. Here they come. They're going to get you, Craig. You're not getting out of detention. I'll be out of here in 10 minutes. <laughs> Not even sure what I really got there. Of course, you know I am I am used to using a controller, so I'm not uh Okay. Ugh, that's that's just gross. A tuft of ginger pubic hair. I mean that's just gross. Okay. Um, anybody who knows me in real life knows that I, I was a big fan of Chef, and I was this, I was really sad when he, uh, um, when he was no longer on South Park. I understand why. It's just, it just sucked anyway. But I, I always liked Chef. I thought he was pretty funny. So, yeah, I miss him anyway. It's. It sucks. Oops. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I love it when you can use stuff in the environment just to be able to take down enemies. It's just fun. I should probably try to do this. You might as well give up because I've hidden the key somewhere and you'll never find it in my office. Oh damn it. Oh yeah, I remember doing this. This is funny. <laughs> Sucker. Yeah, you can sometimes take advantage of the environment just to be able to take down enemies. It's awesome. I remember this. Oh wow. Boobies. Must have. Must touch. Boobies. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah, the gingers in this game aren't terribly bright. Oops. Can I go in there? Okay, I guess I can. Alright. There's probably enough in the value in here. What's this do? 25 extra HP when healed. Okay, that's cool. Alrighty. Cool. Speaking of which, I might as well equip it because I don't have any other, um... 
uh, things I can equip, so... Oops. <laughs> yep, you can tell I haven't played this for a while. So I might as well. I mean, 25 extra HP when I he when healed. From my cold, dead it doesn't hurt. Where's your hall pass? Oh shit. <laughs> I was gonna try to... I'm taking you to detention. Okay. Oh, crap. Messed up on the time in there. Yeah, maybe I'll just use this bow. Yeah, bad seed. Gonna see if I can use that. Okay, I guess not. Oops. Let's see what you've got. I'm gonna see if I can get that uh, that attack to work. This is kind of cool. Oh crap. All right. More officers down. We're taking heavy casualties out here. Damn it, you hallway monitors need to stop playing around. He's got the brass key. He's some kind of dragonborn. Now look, this is detention time. Not time to play Dungeons and Dragons. And besides, he's never going to get inside here because to open the door you need the gold key and the only way to get the gold key is by getting the silver key. Okay, which even if he has a brass key, he still hasn't made it past the boss level. Okay.
Here, guard the key. 